What it do, what it do, it's your man Chronic, sitting here, just got done chopping it up, chilling with one of my OGs, uh, somebody I consider to be very successful at, at what they've done with life, and uh, I try, I make it a point to, you know what I'm saying, link with the people I know that's very successful, you know, at least once a week, once every other week, just to listen, really, sit down, soak up game, because you know, they doing stuff on uh, a different level. You know what I'm saying? One, because they're older than me, so they got a lot to show me. Then second, because, you know, they, they have actually reached the point of success. So it's a lot of things that they do, even though we do different type of businesses. There's a lot of things that they do that I could take and apply to what I do to uh, propel myself forward. So, you know, whenever you can get knowledge, I, I advise that you go get it. But anyways, the uh, conversation we was having while we was chilling was about your word, how important it is. You know, that that was the lesson for the day. So I'm, I'm going to pass it on. They said that literally it was the point in time where they knew the quality of the machine that they were selling wasn't the best. But... They made sure they delivered on that word. So they would tell the truth about the machine. Well, they need help with this and this, that, and the third, right? But then they'll say, but if you buy it from us, we'll give you this uh, expansion pack. We'll give you this kit. We'll do this for you. We'll, we'll make it lucrative for you. So you can use it and, you know, do what you need to with it. And he said they got them more sales than anything else. They had salesmen that would pitch the thing and they're supposed to be professional salesmen and it wouldn't sell as well and he equated that to if you're a salesman people understand at some point you lying i mean it's, it's that simple you know what I'm saying i ain't gonna go all the way around how he said it but at the, at the end of the day most people know when they're talking to a salesman that most salesmen they're gonna lie and say whatever it is they gotta say to you just to get that sale you know, it's not about really helping you. It's about their bottom line. And he was saying it took him longer to make it to his position of where he is in life. But since he's gotten there, he's lasted longer than most of the people that he know. And he equates that to standing on his word. People come back and do business with you. People want to do business with you because they know you're going to stand on your word. So, you know, my advice to any and everybody that's going into any business, whether it be, as I always say, whether it be music or anything else that you want to do in life, make your word concrete. And, and not just concrete, make it a for real foundation. You should be able to build a house on it. And if you can't, as soon as you realize your word was, you know, out of line and you can't build a house on it, go back, apologize and correct it. You know what I'm saying? It seems like that's the hardest thing for people to do sometimes. Admit, hey, I was wrong. Uh, uh, I need to fix this. And, you know, that's not hard for me to do. I actually own up to the things that I'm wrong about fast. Because the faster you own up to it, then the faster you can start soaking up the lesson that you learn from it. You know, we're going to make mistakes. It's not about not making mistakes. It's about learning from it every time. So the next time you get to that situation, you know not to do that again. So, you know what I'm saying? As soon as you see your word, hey, you know what? I thought I could deliver this or I thought this was how it go or whatever. As soon as you get there immediately, you know, just, hey, make a phone call. Hey, we need to sit down and talk. Something changed, anything. And, you know, that was his advice. It's not, he said, it's not like you're going to be a, you can't predict the future. So, you can tell somebody, I'm going to have something for you Tuesday, and something go crazy, and you don't have it for them Tuesday. You can't predict it. But what you can do is, as soon as it gets out of line and you can't do what you said you was going to do, you can be big enough to hurry up, reach out to that contact. Hey, look, something came up. This is what's going on, yada, yada, yada. It's going to take me a little bit more time. So, you know, like I said, I'm just passing the knowledge on as I get it. I'm giving it to y'all. Stand on your word. It's your man Chronic. I'm out.